Common criteria 7.3 for SOC 2 compliance is really getting into incident response because the requirement is about taking action after you've analyzed a particular security event. You know, is this a real security event? Is this something that could impact us negatively and prevent us from achieving our objectives? If so, it is an incident and it should rise to the level of an incident and we're going to activate our incident response plan in order to take the proper action to um, respond to it. And so being able to define what an incident is, is is important first of all. You want to clearly know what rises to the level of an incident and when it is that the incident response team activates. And that team needs to go through practices, scenarios, training in order to know how to respond appropriately in order to not only contain the incident but um, resolve it, learn from it, and develop further procedures so that you're even better prepared the next time you face one of those incidents.